Alestra, Wikipedia article audio. Alestra is a fat substitute that adds no fat, calories, or cholesterol to products. It has been used in the preparation of otherwise high-fat foods such as potato chips, thereby lowering or eliminating their fat content. The Food and Drug Administration originally approved Alestra for use as a replacement for fats and oils in pre-packaged ready-to-eat snacks in 1996, concluding that such use meets the safety standard for food additives, reasonable certainty of no harm. In the late 1990s, Alestra lost its popularity due to side effects but products containing the ingredient can still be purchased at grocery stores in some countries. Commercialization Side effects Chemistry Applications Notes Alestra was discovered accidentally by Procter & Gamble researchers F. Matson and R. Volpenhein in 1968 while researching fats that could be more easily digested by premature infants. In 1971, PNG met with the Food and Drug Administration to examine what sort of testing would be required to introduce Alestra as a food additive. During the following tests, PNG noticed a decline in blood cholesterol levels as a side effect of Alestra replacing natural dietary fats. Following this potentially lucrative possibility, in 1975, PNG filed a new request with the FDA to use Alestra as a drug, specifically to lower cholesterol levels. The lengthy series of studies that followed failed, however to demonstrate the 15% reduction required by the FDA to be approved as a treatment. Further work on Alestra languished. In 1984, the FDA allowed Kellogg to claim publicly that their high-fiber breakfast cereals were effective in reducing the risk of cancer. PNG immediately started another test series that lasted three years. When these tests were completed, PNG filed for approval as a food additive for up to 35% replacement of fats in home cooking and 75% in commercial uses. One of the main concerns the FDA had about Alestra was it might encourage consumers to eat more of the top of the pyramid foods because of the perception of its being healthier. This could result in consumers engaging in overconsumption thinking the addition of Alestra would remove negative consequences. In light of this possibility, approving it as an additive would have meant consumers would be consuming a food with a relatively high amount of an additive, whose long-term health effects were not documented. This made the FDA particularly hesitant to approve the product, as well as the side effects, such as diarrhea and concern for the loss of fat-soluble vitamins. In August 1990, PNG narrowed their focus to savory snacks, potato chips, tortilla chips, crackers and similar foods. By this point, the original patents were approaching their 1995 expiration. PNG lobbied for an extension which they received in December 1993. This extension lasted until January 25, 1996. With pressure from PNG, the approval was finally granted on January 24, one day before the patent expired, automatically extending the patent two years. At the time of the 1996 ruling, FDA concluded that, to avoid being misbranded, Alestra-containing foods would need to bear a label statement to inform consumers about possible effects of Alestra on the gastrointestinal system. The label statement also would clarify that the added vitamins were present to compensate for any nutritional effects of Alestra, rather than to provide enhanced nutritional value. 
The FDA later removed the label saying that the current label does not accurately communicate information to consumers. The FDA also agreed with PNG that the label statement could be misleading and cause consumers of Alestra to attribute serious problems to Alestra when this was unlikely to be the case. Alestra was approved by the Food and Drug Administration for use as a food additive in 1996, and was initially used in potato chips under the WOW brand by Frito-Lay. In 1998, the first year Alestra products were marketed nationally after the FDA's Food Advisory Committee confirmed a judgment it made two years earlier, sales were over $400 million. By 2000, though, sales slowed to $200 million. PNG abandoned attempts to widen the uses of Alestra, and sold off its Cincinnati-based factory to Twin Rivers Technologies in February 2002. As of 2013, the Lay's light chips were still available, listing Alestra as an ingredient. Pringles Light Potato Crisps, manufactured by Kellogg's, use Olean brand Alestra. Starting in 1996, an FDA-mandated health warning label read this product contains Alestra. Alestra may cause abdominal cramping and loose stools. Alestra inhibits the absorption of some vitamins and other nutrients. Vitamins A, D, E, and K have been added. These symptoms, normally occurring only by excessive consumption in a short period of time, are known as steatorrhea, and caused by an excess of fat in stool. The FDA removed the warning requirement in 2003, as it had conducted a scientific review of several post-market studies submitted by PNG as well as adverse event reports submitted by PNG and the Center for Science in the Public Interest. The FDA concluded the label statement was no longer warranted. The FDA also agreed with PNG that the label statement could be misleading and cause consumers of Alestra to attribute serious problems to Alestra when this unlikely to be the case. When removing the Alestra warning label, the FDA cited a six-week PNG study of more than 3,000 people showing the Alestra eating group experienced only a small increase in bowel movement frequency compared to the control group. The FDA concluded that subjects eating Alestra-containing chips were no more likely to report having had loose stools, abdominal cramps, or any other GI symptom compared to subjects eating an equivalent amount of chips. In addition to the effects of the health warnings on public acceptance of the product, Alestra might not have lived up to consumer expectations of speedy results. If consumers believed they could eat more to compensate for the fat calories saved, Alestra would not be an effective way to improve overall diet. The manufacturers claim that the authentic taste and feel of Alestra offsets this tendency, and some studies have shown that people who consume foods with Alestra don't eat more to offset the loss in calories. PNG conducted publicity campaigns to highlight Alestra's benefits, including working directly with the healthcare community. Alestra is prohibited from sale in many markets, including the European Union and Canada. Consumption of Alestra may encourage rats to eat too much of foods containing regular fats, due to the learning of an incorrect association between fat intake and calories. Rats that were fed regular potato chips as well as chips cooked with Alestra gained more weight when subsequently eating a high-fat diet than rats that received just regular chips. Triglycerides, the energy-yielding dietary fats, consist of three fatty acids bonded to a glycerol backbone. Because Alestra is synthesized from sucrose, it can bond with six, seven, or eight fatty acids. The resulting radial arrangement is too large and irregular to move through the intestinal wall and be absorbed. 
Alestra has the same taste and mouth feel as fat, but it passes through the gastrointestinal tract undigested without contributing calories or nutritive value to the diet. From a mechanical point of view, scientists were able to manipulate the compound in such a way that it could be used in place of cooking oils in the preparation of many types of food. Since it contains fatty acid functional groups, Alestra is able to dissolve lipid-soluble vitamins such as vitamin D, vitamin E, vitamin K, and vitamin A, along with carotenoids. Fat-soluble nutrients consumed with Alestra products are excreted with the undigested Alestra molecules. To counteract this loss of nutrients, products made with Alestra are fortified with oil-soluble vitamins. PNG is marketing its sucrose ester products under the brand Cephos for use as an industrial lubricant and paint additive. Because Alestra is made by chemically combining sugar and vegetable oil, it releases no toxic fumes and could potentially become a safe and environmentally friendly replacement for petrochemicals in these applications. It is currently used as a base for deck stains and a lubricant for small power tools, and there are plans to use it on larger machinery. In 1999, researchers discovered Alestra helps facilitate the removal of toxins from the brain, as it apparently binds to dioxins in a manner similar to that of normal fats. This unexpected side effect may make the substance useful in treating victims of dioxin poisoning. In 2005, research by groups at University of Cincinnati School of Medicine in Ohio and the University of Western Australia indicates Alestra can be used to treat poisoning due to exposure to polychlorinated biphenyls, including chloracne symptoms.